This is where we are now, folks. Page 57. Student's work. So, there was a, a request re uh, recently for IELTS uh, essay feedback. So this is what we're looking at right here, essay feedback. Oh, there, there, there is something here. It's a little memento from Mo, not, sorry, not Mo, Pau, Pau in 6-4, who was an artist. So he, his piece is called Remembering Classmates. So those, that's all his friends in his room. I will treasure that forever. Okay, so uh, here we have an essay feedback from Siriwat in 6-2. He, I helped him with, with IELTS preparation on a one-to-one -one basis and ultimately he did very well. He got 6.5 band score, which is what he needed for university. So that's really cool. I think he's studying engineering, but I'm not 100% sure. Engineering or computer something or other. Okay, so that's a uh, serial. Um, I have highlighted some of the issues. And then on the next page, uh, writing task one, there's feedback. And uh, anything that's highlighted is the, um, the feedback. Okay, next, uh, pretest. I give pretests all the time to give the students, to make them more comfortable about doing the exams. In the uh, evaluation, uh, one student uh, wrote by, uh, gave, um, he didn't identify himself. But what he said was that he's very uncomfortable when it comes to exams. I can, I think most of us can identify with that, especially subjects like physics or chemistry that are very difficult. Um, okay, so this was Boomer, an excellent student in room one. He uh, completed the, um, the pretest. And then finally, there is a, um, a spreadsheet with scores for what room, room, room one, and I'm pretty sure this is semester two. And I try to give, um, there, there is quite a, a lot of work, but my rationale behind that is that the end score reflects their ability. So I try to, in each area, for example, the reading and writing, I give at least three tasks that I collect and um, grade similarly with listening and speaking and so on my formatives uh, a the rationale behind formative is to evaluate what we've looked at in class and to see what we need to review for the the next exam and that's how i use the formatives and then effective domain well in this particular case all the students got 100 percent and then on the next page we have the um, attendance so I do take attendance it's apparently taking attendance is one part of a student a teacher being organized which can impact the students intrinsic motivation and then finally 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 midterm exam study guide there there is a frontispiece piece for that and on the back you will see on the very last page page 60 you will see the study guide. Okay, thank you for your attention and have a good day. Ta-ra!